Good afternoon guys. Um, today um, it's going to be quite a quick video I suppose really. It's about cleaning your wheels. We're Mark and V and this is our adventures. Beetles wheels are absolute filthy and um, I've been out trying to clean them now. If I just take you out and show you the state of the wheels. That's one. I'm going to come around. In fact, this car just gets used and abused so it doesn't get cleaned very often. You can see the state of the wheels. I'm going to come around and I've been trying to clean these with a power washer. You can see the power washers touch them a little bit but not very much now. I've come around to this final wheel and I've tried something different and that's what this video is going to be about. I mean that's not perfect by any means but God didn't it make a difference. So. I'll show you first of all what we started doing. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to show you this power washer, and then hopefully you can see that it's set onto the maximum setting, so it's really, really quite powerful. Um, Clutcher, power washer, so you know, you know, it's a decent power washer. Now you watch this. <laughs> See, that's just not touching it at all. V introduced me to this stuff, which I laughed about a little bit to be perfectly honest initially. This stuff here, it's called elbow grease. You bought it from BM? BM, yeah, most shops sell it now. Yeah, but elbow grease, okay. Pound a bottle. Pound a bottle. So what I'm gonna do, um using a scrubbing brush, some elbow grease. I'm just going to spray it on liberally. And V don't mind me making this video because it gets her car clean. V <laughs> doesn't like cleaning the car. Right, so just spray it on liberally. Um, just start anywhere really. You can see it starts lifting it. You know, it's not going to do it magically. You do have to put a bit of effort in. But I'm, you know, quite honestly, I'm not really putting that much effort in. You saw that power wash, it just wouldn't touch it. And these wheels aren't in the best condition either. So, you know, afterwards when you see this, like, look, imperfections in the paintwork and everything, you know, I'm not worried about that. That's not what we're talking about. We're talking about getting this crud off. I mean, if you buy an older car and it's not been looked after, this might just help you. you see, look at that. Look how quickly that's lifted that off and you saw the power wash on it earlier. One of these little scrubbing brushes, a couple of quid. Not very much, is it? Just, I think the um, elbow grease is a couple of quid, maybe. The elbow grease is a pound, and the brushes you can buy for a pound all in B&M. All right, so there's a B&M <laughs> advert. Yeah. So come on, B&M. Well, any like, you know, pound shop, places like that, to sell all this sort of thing. So let's get that one in a bit. Always a bit more difficult around the valve. I don't know if any of you got beetles out there, but we've got a few problems with a beetle at the moment, so I'm thinking about doing a few little videos about fixing things. Uh, door lock's not working properly, the boot lock's not working properly. We had a problem earlier on today where um, the throttle valve stuck, so it was making the car cut out. We fixed that. Really, really quite simple, so I'm not even sure you how to do that in the video. You know, tell me if you want to know something about a beetle, and maybe we'll see if we can't replicate it. This is a convertible as well. So, that's just a quick going over. That is just a very, very quick going over. So, uh, just to, uh, yeah. 
same, I've not touched it. It's one constant video. You see that, it's still a catcher, so I'm going to start again. <laughs> A little bit more needed to be done, but oh my god, how quick was that and how much better was that? Run the valve, there's a little bit, I said that was a bit difficult to get into, so I'm going to have to do that again. But what do you think guys? That's pretty damn brilliant, isn't it? Right, thanks for watching the video guys. I hope that's been helpful. I mean, it's something I just stumbled across today and I'm amazed. If you liked it, you know, give the video a thumbs up and um, you know, if you want to see more little tips like that, ask down below about you know, any beetle things. Well, you know, anything you think you might think I can answer you. And if you want to see more, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video. See you later guys. Bye.